We will learn about Drip email marketing in this tutorial. Basically, Drip is a feature-rich and user-friendly email marketing platform. I had no trouble importing a client list or setting up routines, such as welcome emails for new subscribers and abundant basket emails. Simply open your browser, type drip.com and hit the enter key to bring up the website's homepage. Visit the page by scrolling down. Here are some image tutorials. It is demonstrated in this tutorial. Scroll down to the option for email creation. Additionally, there is the analytics option, which we also go over in class. We can see that three, over 3000 markings cannot be incorrect. View more options by scrolling down. Try drip free now. Simply click it to fill out the form. Enter your first and last names, email addresses, company name, corporate website, the number of contacts you have, your password, and then click free trial to begin. A welcome screen will numerous ask <clears throat> A welcome screen with numerous options will now appear. Shopify, WooCommerce, BigCommerce, Magento, and other options will be given. Choose one and click the next button. Add your email sending address now. In addition to entering the address line 1, address line 2, city, street, postal code and country. Input default from named default from email. Choose your country by scrolling down and clicking it. And complete the setup. The home page is now visible on the screen. We have numerous options including automated process, single email campaign, and from form campaign. Enter and scroll down to launch various tasks. Importing your email subscribers will be your first option. Open it right away and a page with instructions on how to import data into Drip will appear on the right side. We can easily add people to it as well. You may also enter your email address. To learn more, we may also view a video here. Here, there are several field formats, format tags, etc. I have now selected the first possibility, which is humans. Just click it, active, inactive, save segments, tags, bulk operations, and trimming operations will all be available on the menu. Selecting the active option, we have a choice of standards. Simply select the filter. Select any filter by scrolling down. After selecting a filter, a variety of options are displayed. There are options for marking performances on the right side and the choice of active people there are a lot of choices on the list you may also enter time delay second delay before re reappearing and delay before reappearing it is if dismissed in the behavior option press the done button proceed to the third option submission thank you double opt-in and automated options are available here after selecting after scrolling is complete, a thank you message appears on the form. Here the text can be edited and the take care notice can be added. Then click the done button. You can now construct your form as well. You can now construct your form as all of the options have been completed. Go to the campaigns button right away. We have a variety of collapse menus available including single emails then access email templates just click it a template is loaded after a brief period we have a drip we have a drip template here along with my most recent templates start from scratch is located on the left side of the drip templates the option to create a new template will show up on the screen here we can provide the template's name and select create template a temporary screen will then appear, add a new image, drag the template collapse after selecting the image option. You can select the image on the left side, click on it to upload an image from your computer. In a few while your image will emerge, you can now insert your text. 
click on it to edit the text as well the typefaces and alignments of the texts are also editable now select button from the menu and then drag and drop a button change the url color and width of the button after it has been dropped now have the choice to display a spacer social media and a section of the and a section on the hidden screen as well so when you do it this is the default option simply select the done button my template is now displayed on a hidden screen under the campaign option we can see our template right here we may also view an various response modes on devices including tablets laptops and more additionally we can add new workflow additionally we can add new workflows to our screens and use the analytical option just scroll down to examine the available options we have the ability to change the date and time and use it account levels will be present we only export csv and offer a variety of analytic email metrics and email types there are various rendering options in it simply scroll down make your selections and save it to see how your website is set up our tutorial has now come to a conclusion and i hope you fully comprehend what a drip email is so this is end of our today's video hope you enjoyed it and learned it if you have any questions about this tutorial please leave a comment with them subscribe to the channel as well stay careful and safe